Weight Shift Control 3-1 Components and Systems Let's delve into the fascinating intricacies of the wing frame components in Weight Shift Control aircraft. Picture, if you will, the fundamental structure of these wings, the leading edges, keel, crossbar, pilot control frame, king post, wires, and struts, all working in concert to define the very essence of control in WSC aviation. Our journey begins with the leading edges, those pivotal tube assemblies situated at the front of the wing airfoil. Swept back with a purpose, they shape the very core of the wing and, fascinatingly, exhibit flexibility as part of the overall wing structure. Picture the symphony of internal and external sleeving, strategically reinforcing these edges, and varying flex characteristics based on specific designs. And yes, for the pragmatists among us, the outboard sections graciously bow out for convenient wing packing. Enter the wing keel, akin to the keel of a boat. It's not merely a center, it's the structural nexus. This component doesn't flex, it serves as the steadfast anchor for various wing elements. It's where the carriage attaches, the keel pocket resides, and the crossbar finds its reference. There's a choreography to its rigidity, yet it knows when to allow controlled movement for the delicate art of roll. Ah, the crossbar, our tensioned hero hinged above the keel, orchestrating the ballet of leading edges. Imagine its role. Under compression, rigid, averse to any notion of bending during flight. It's a structural maestro, ensuring the wing's integrity at all times. And for our logistical minds, behold the ballet of cables releasing tension, allowing the wing to fold gracefully for transport and storage. Now, let's not forget the figures, those visual aids that bring theory to life. A visual hymn to the wing and carriage of a WSC aircraft. Take a closer look at unraveling the intricate dance of wing frame components. Marvel at where leading edge assembly unfolds its secrets. And, of course, absorb the visual poetry of witnessing the crossbar tensioning cables in action. In this symposium on aeronautical engineering, every component has a role, every structure a purpose. As we decipher the ballet of WSC wing frames, remember that behind these technicalities lies the poetry of flight. Now, Let's unravel the engineering poetry of the control frame, the backbone that unites the lower structure of the wing with the very control bar manipulated by the skilled pilot. In our exploration, we encounter the down tubes, extending gracefully from the keel attachment to the horizontal base tube, the very control bar that dictates the dance of the WSC aircraft. Visualize the control frame corner brackets, the unsung heroes supporting structural flying wires and cables, intricately attached to leading edges and crossbar junctions. During the ballet of flight, the down tubes stand in compression, mirroring the structural demands placed upon the crossbar. These tubes, straight and stiff, hold a symphony of tension and compression. The control bar, our protagonist, remains under tension during flight, a pivotal force in the delicate equilibrium of the WSC structure. Behold the flying wires, thick, structural 1 8 inch cables that bear the weight of the wing, ensuring stability fore and aft. The front and rear flying wires, akin to the puppeteer's strings, tether the control frame, dictating its position with precision. Side flying wires provide lateral stability, a symphony of forces to hold the wings steadfast in flight. For the realm of training and shared control, training bars emerge, a dual control marvel allowing both instructor and passenger to partake in the aerial ballet. The intricacies of this setup provide a glimpse into the versatility of WSC aircraft. Enter the king post. A stalwart companion to the lower control frame, offering support for upper ground wires that anchor the wing during ground operations and bear negative loads in flight. Transition to the topless wings with struts, a design marvel reminiscent of airplanes, substituting side flying wires with struts. Picture the strutted wings, eliminating the need for a king post, and offering a shorter height for streamlined hangar accommodation. The visual poetry extends to the option of folding wings while still on the carriage, a logistical symphony for storage and transport. Visualize the strutted wings with a clean upper surface, devoid of holes for king posts or wires. This, my dear audience, is not just an aesthetic choice, it's a strategic one, minimizing interference drag and enhancing overall efficiency. Let the figures guide your imagination. A corner bracket revealing the intricate web of wires and cables. An embodiment of the control frame with its down tubes, control bar, and wires, awaiting the touch of a pilot. Capturing the essence of training bars, opening the door to shared flight experiences. The sail, meticulously designed to integrate seamlessly with the wing frame, 
is a bespoke component, ensuring it cannot be interchanged with other sails or wings. In modern sail design, complex geometry and precise sewing contribute to high efficiency. The flexibility of the wing frame, combined with advanced sail design techniques, allows for a curved leading edge, enhancing overall efficiency and stability, clean upper surface of strutted wing. To maintain the airfoil shape, stiff preformed battens act as airfoil ribs from the root to the tips. A foam or mylar stiffener inserted in a leading edge pocket ensures rigidity from the leading edge to the airfoil high point. Double surface wings may incorporate additional ribs on the bottom surface for camber maintenance. Engineered from polyester materials with varying weaves, thicknesses, and orientations, the sail material is precisely cut into panels by automated machines. These panels are then sewn together using high strength thread, providing the necessary stiffness and flexibility tailored to the specific wing design. Strategic pockets accommodate battens, and hardware is installed for wing frame and wire attachments. Trailing edge lines or wires may be included for reinforcement and tuning. Various batten ties secure the battens in place, each unique to the manufacturer's design, trailing edge of the sail showing reinforcement panels, trailing edge line, and batten ties with attachment hardware. Affixed at the nose and tips, the sail is securely attached to the wing frame. A keel pocket towards the sail's back ensures a stable connection to the wing keel, keel pocket. Cables play a critical role in holding components in place and acting as structural elements to carry loads. Constructed from stainless steel, flight, and ground cables are attached to components using tangs or other hardware. Thimbles and swagged fittings secure the cables at each end. Various hardware types are employed for attaching these swagged cable fittings to the airframe, crossbar tensioning junction attachment example, view inside wing showing top wire coming through sail attached to the crossbar.